Hi hey babes, welcome back to another vlog. Today the is Smooth Jazz on Amazon Music. Alexa, stop. I don't know what that was about. Today is Sunday, March the 10th. I've been editing a vlog that I was going to post. I've been editing it since Friday. Dropped my hard drive and now it will not connect to my Mac. So when I go to my editing software, it says footage lost, can't be found. So it's all red. All of my footage is gone. That means Brazil, Puerto Rico from spring break last year. We went to Aruba. Like I have so much stuff on this hard drive and that lets me know I need to have a backup plan. But this is crazy. I'm gonna bake some salmon in the oven. Rice, cauliflower, stir fry. We're on our eating clean 100% journey. And I think I told y'all this before, no sugar, no dairy, no gluten, no soy, no coffee, and no alcohol. I started that on March the 4th. Today's the 10th, so it's going good so far. You guys know I pretty much eat clean anyway, so we just got to eat. Let me turn this TV down. Okay, so let's go ahead and cook dinner for the kids. I'm gonna make them some tempura cauliflower. My son loves this, so I'm gonna make this for him with the salmon and then some sweet corn. So let's get to cooking. Today's Monday. I've been working all morning. I did not pick the camera up anymore yesterday. I was still so disgusted from my external hard drive dropping and not working. I did find two locations. They're not located here. I basically have to go to a FedEx or UPS, ship it to them. They'll fix it, give me an estimate in one or two days. So that's where we are with that. Still trying, trying to see if it's worth me paying what I was quoted to get that footage back. So I think I'm asleep on it and then I'll know. But anyway, right now we're about to make us a quick, quick little snack. So I just toasted some Ezekiel bread. Ezekiel bread is absolutely amazing for you. If you on this health fitness journey, I am working on that six pack in your abs. I say probably 95% of that is the kitchen. I'm going to put this non-dairy cream cheese i got this from i believe i got this either from trader joe's or sprout or whole foods i can't remember but i got it from one of those so we about to put this on here and then i also have microgreens I got from trader joe's but you can get them anywhere that's an assortment of different microgreens so i'll put that on top and then i'll put my tomatoes on there too so let's go ahead and make this I want to make some sausage too. I have a meeting at noon and it is 11.44 right now. So I have 15 minutes to do all of this. Let's go ahead and hurry up and make this. Here is our quick breakfast. This is chicken sausage and then of course Ezekiel bread with the vegan cream cheese. 
microgreens and tomatoes. Bon appetit. Give me some to work with, can you just reassure me? Headed to a parent series. Just wearing something. Y'all have seen this striped shirt before. It goes off shoulder, but I have it with my oversized cardigan sweater. These jeans are so old. Don't even remember where they're from. Um, they're high waisted and they're like paper bag at the top. Where are my Tory Burch flats? And then, of course, my YSL everyday purse. Y'all know it is braid season so we got our braids in probably we'll have these in all summer long because with working out and with weather changing and starting to get hot and humid who's wearing hair so y'all will see me in these braids for quite a while y'all want to know who i go to hit me up i will send you her information she is amazing i get the silver braided in now and i absolutely love it so i will check back in with y'all i'll try to bring y'all with me to this series to get some little snippets but we'll see babes it's the next day i just did drop off at school but i wanted to tell y'all about yesterday let me get my book so yesterday I met Jennifer Wallace. She did a seminar and she wrote this book here and I'm gonna read it. It was so good. I'll put the link. I'll try to find it. They said it was being recorded and it would be posted. So I'll try to get you the information if you're interested. But it's called Never Enough. It's basically about children and how you can help them navigate through school, social skills and so forth. Uh, letting them know that they matter because she was saying that out of all of her research search with psychiatrists and psychologists and and such that she found that 85 percent of kids feel like they don't matter and feels like the household is happier when they get good grades so that's a big deal so i really 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 enjoyed her seminar that she did yesterday it was only an hour long it was just more so an introduction and to go into what her book was and about what she found in, in her research. So I did purchase her book and I do plan on reading it. I'll let y'all know how that goes. So right now we're about to make what we do every morning. Let me go get it. And I need to buy me some um, more containers. I don't like that it's leaning up to me and not eye level with me like this. So let me see what I can prop this up with. This, it works better. Oh, so, y'all been rocking with me for a minute. Y'all know that I use Arbonne products. This is my go-to. I use this every single morning. It is your 37 different fruits and veggies. So this is the first thing I drink every morning and then I add in gut health. This is my pre and probiotic. Y'all know gut health is sexy. So I basically combine these two items together. And then I also add a splash of lemon juice in it because lemons are good for you. So that's what we about to do right now. And like I said, I just use one scoop. I just put it in my cup. And then here's the sticks of the gut health. And I basically just pour this in like that. Mix it up and then I add some water. Don't y'all hate, look at this. I fill this thing up every day. My husband and my son, they just grab water and stick it in there. Ain't nobody filling it up. But no, this ain't gonna be enough. So I'm gonna have to get some from my fridge for my filtered water. Don't y'all just love that? Go in and get what you need and then it ain't even there. I usually just stir this up first before I add my lemon. And I just use my frother. Let me froth it up. Let me go ahead and put some water in this. Ooh, child. So that's that. Let me get my lemon. And I just take a little bit each day. I have a whole bag of lemons in there. And I really probably don't even need to buy a whole bag. And then I make sure I get all the seeds out of the lemon because you don't want seeds inside your green drink and then you can't down it like you want to. Why do lemons have so much seeds? Let's put this in the fridge. And then I just squeeze, squeeze the lemon in there. 
Like I said, this has 37 different fruits and veggies. It is vegan, no soy, no gluten, all of that good stuff for you. So if you don't get your greens in for the day, this is perfect. If you're interested, I'll have a link linked below. You can purchase it. But once again, it is my superfood greens. Like I said, I do this every single morning. So cheers. Let's get into it. Love is blind. Do y'all watch Love is Blind? I watched the reunion yesterday. First of all, I have been rooting for Clay and AD. That's really the only reason I was watching season six. I really have never watched Love is Blind before. I might have watched the first season and then I kind of stopped watching it. But Clay and AD, when I saw season six, I was like, okay. I watched the reunion yesterday and girl. So they was calling out everybody up in that reunion show. And I actually fell asleep, so I do need to finish it. But I think his name is Trevor. How he gonna come on the show? I had a whole girlfriend and then comes on the show looking for love. It was gonna marry somebody. Like, I think his name is Trevor. Like, what? Where they do that at? Honey, that reunion was so good. What I saw anyway, I need to go back and watch the rest of it. I probably watched half of it and then fell asleep on the last tail end of it. I know season seven probably won't be good as season six, so I probably won't watch season seven. I really hope that AD does not take Clay back. I'm just saying. He had his chance and then on the couch, he's talking about, oh, I'm in love with you. You are the love of my life. Like she said, then why ain't we married? So if y'all haven't watched it, y'all tune in. Watch Love is Blind. It's on Netflix, so you can catch up. Season six, my opinion, I'm going to say the best season. I didn't watch one through five. I'll probably watch the beginning of season one and never watched again. But season six, it's good. Now, I will typically make my tea. I drink this clean tox tea. It is a detox tea, but it's a very mild. When I say mild, it's mild. It's a herbal detox tea, and it's made with... It has licorice and milk thistle in it. It's a elder flower mint flavor. And it's so good. When I tell y'all, when y'all start this, you're going to be hooked. I drink this every morning too. These are four things that I will make sure that I always have on deck. Because I do, it, it, it's my regimen every single morning. I start with my green shot, toss that back. And I actually put a lot of water in there. Really, you could do four ounces. That's probably six ounces. It's so good. I've had and tasted other greens, and this by far is my favorite one. But I'm going to do my tea now. You do it just like you do normal tea, girl. I just keep the bag in there the whole time I drink my tea. It's very mild. It's not going to send you running to the bathroom. It just works with you naturally. Once my tea is done, I will add in my fizz. They also have the regular sticks that have caffeine, but it's all natural caffeine. And all their products are vegan, not, no soy, um, gluten-free, all that good stuff. But I just basically pour one of these fizz sticks into my tea, and it gives me the same effect as it would by drinking a cup of coffee. If I you're looking for that coffee fix but don't want to drink coffee, I'll do my tea now. I will drink coffee sometimes, but just not every day. And I love me a good matcha, so. And I just literally bought me a new matcha kit because I didn't have the wooden whisk and it actually just came in the mail. So I actually just ordered this, which I have, the, I have a bowl and all that stuff, but I needed the whisk. So I was like, you know what? Let me just go buy a whole new set. But this is what I just purchased. And it comes with the whisk, a bowl, a little matcha stick to dip the matcha out. It has the whisk holder and then the sifter because you're supposed to sift your matcha and I've never done that, so. And I was watching Aaliyah's face and I was like, oh girl, cause I make matchas all the time, but I'm like, you know what? Let me go on and get me a whisk cause I didn't have one. I do love matcha. I'm gonna pour in my fizz, which fizzes up, and this is what makes this a tizzy. You can also add this fizz or a midday pick-me-up to if you have sparkling water or something like that and you just need a midday pick-me-up. This is also good for that. I don't typically do that. What I add in my tea every morning is my collagen. This is the brand that I use, Vital Proteins. 
So that's what we add to our tea and that's what we drink. That's our routine, we do that every morning. If you want any more deets on that, of course everything will be linked down below. On my lunch hour, just cut up some strawberries and I'm about to make this Argentina red shrimp and I'm gonna put it on top of my Caesar and I'm gonna make me a shrimp Caesar salad. These shrimp Caesar wraps are so good. You see, it took me not even five minutes to make it. The Argentina shrimp I get from Trader Joe's. And it comes with a little butter seasoning pack. It's like a garlicky type butter. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but it gives it so much good flavor. I use organic romaine lettuce. And then I buy my Caesar salad kit. You can buy that from Publix. Costco, uh, Kroger, any market. package I got was some leggings that I ordered these are just like some burnt orange I got them in a size medium you just never know ordering off of Amazon you just don't know what the fit is but I feel like the waist looks super small but I like these because they don't have that middle seam I hate workout pants that have the middle seam like these these right here that I have on they have a middle seam right here down the middle and I hate that so I've been trying to purchase more workout pants or leggings that don't have that middle seam coming down the middle. So I'll let y'all know. I'll link them below if I like them. If I don't like them, I ain't gonna link them. I also ordered this color. My trainer is having an event this weekend and she wants you to wear pink and I don't own nothing pink. So I wanted to order something and these are like light pink. I was trying to get something that's still neutral because y'all know I'm not a color girl. So these are the same kind of leggings. They're just in this rose color or strawberry milkshake color. And once again, they don't have the seam down the middle. So they feel amazing. So soft. That's what I ordered. I also got two of these travel size Meisler rose water. I use these, but I needed some travel size ones. And I saw Amazon had these, so I just ordered two of them. And I'll just keep the containers and just refill when I'm out of them. That way, I'll always have a travel size. And I don't have to keep buying travel size because I typically buy the big bottle from Target. You're going to make a smoothie. You have to drink protein within an hour of working out. So it took me about 20 minutes to get home. So that's what we about to do now is we about to make this smoothie. I'm about to make a chocolate peanut butter berry. So we gonna make a PB and J protein shake. Chocolate protein from Arbonne.
really is so, so good. I've been doing so good with my workouts, y'all. So this week I'm doing three days a week. Um, I told y'all before my trainer's having an event on Sunday. So I'll be going to that. I am really into my fitness goals and this fitness journey. If you're new here, I broke my foot back in April. So it'll be a year next month that I broke my foot. And when I broke my foot, I kind of fell off with my healthy lifestyle. Because it is a lifestyle, guys. It's not something that you just do one day or do for 30 days or do for 60 days. It is absolutely a lifestyle. So fell into a rut when I broke my foot because when I couldn't work out and workouts for me is my stress reliever. That's the one thing that I do for myself that I really enjoy and it just makes me feel good. It makes me feel, it just makes me feel good. I, I don't think about anything else when I'm working out. I just work out, get a good sweat. I can't even describe it, but that is my thing. So when I wasn't able to work out, it kind of put me in a mood. Well, we out of that mood, y'all. So back to square one, I am doing a 30 day, no sugar, no soy, no dairy, no gluten, no coffee and no alcohol. I'm not a real big alcohol drinker anyway. I'm not a real big coffee drinker anyway. So those things are not hard for me. The hardest thing for me is sugar, chocolate chip cookie, creme brulee, pie, anything with sugar. I mean, that's probably everybody's nemesis. That's probably the hardest part for me, but I've been doing some things around that, just making a smoothie that gives me, satisfies that sweet tooth. I'll eat a dark chocolate covered protein bar that takes away that sweet tooth. So things like that that are healthy for me, I will eat it, but if it's just sugar, like a cookie cake, pies, things like that's not good for you, I'm not eating it. So that's been a struggle, but at this point, it's all good because like I said, I satisfy my sweet tooth. It's been working out good. I'm about to go back downstairs and work. My lunch hour is over. EGI Friday. I'm so glad it's Friday. This has been such a long week. It's rainy outside today, but it is nice. So it's like 74, 75 outside. So I'll take it. I think it's gonna rain all weekend, but I'm not sure. I'll have to check. Oh, I wanna show y'all one other thing that I got from Amazon. I will link these below, but these right here, I found these on Amazon. They are straw covers for your Stanley Cup or any cup that you have, but you know how the Stanley Cup doesn't have anything that covers up your straw, which sometimes can be disgusting if you're out. My phone ringing. But this right here, I will tag below, and it just gives you a different assortment, or you can just buy the color you want, but it works so well. Here's the straw. I have a, I thought it was a tan color, but once I put it onto my Stanley Cup, it looks more like it's a pale pink color. So it just slides on your straw like this. And then you can cover up your straw. It's not open to all of the elements when you're in the gym, if you're at the store, wherever you take your Stanley Cup. I pretty much only take mine to the gym or if I'm riding in a car. Um, so I have my water at all times. But yeah, this is pretty cool. I love it. I think I paid $6 for... There's one, two... There were four in here. Six bucks for these, so... Definitely something to think about. Good morning, babes. Welcome back to another day. Today is Saturday, and I am up doing my daily things, getting my green drink. I've already gotten the shower, I got dressed. I have my Bible study at 8. It is 7.56. So, running a little late. We're going to have a busy, busy day today. Yesterday, I went to the Apple store and I bought me a new MacBook Pro. But I got there at like 7, so I ended up getting a discount. The way I had to get the discount, I had to go in through their computer. You have to purchase it online and then, then do pick up in store in order to get the discount. So I did that and so I have to pick it up today. So I don't know what time I'll be able to do that, but we'll go at some point today to go pick up our new MacBook. And then of course I'll do an unboxing and all that good stuff. But I needed a new MacBook. My book I have now is from 2010. That's right. That's what I said, 2010. So it is so, so slow. So I got a M3 Pro chip, so. 
my husband, he helped uh, tremendously with exactly what I need. I mainly use it for editing my vlog, so I'm so excited to have something much, much faster. Still trying to figure out how to get my external hard drive, how to extract those files that I have on there. Really hoping and praying I can get that done. It's going to cost me though, so I'm trying to call around. My next stop is going to be... Last time I think I told y'all that I was going through some company where I had to ship it off. I didn't want to do all that. Somebody told me to try Geek Squad at Best Buy. So I'm going to try them and see if they can possibly extract that data and see what they're going to call. So they probably going to be the most expensive route. But I can just you know around and get some estimates and see go with the cheapest bidder. <laughs> Cause I ain't spent, trying to spend thousands of dollars. You know what I'm saying? I want the footage, but not that bad. But we'll check back in with y'all. We about to do our Bible study, take our green shot. Then we are literally out of this house by nine to get to the gym by 9.30. yesterday I did a lot I picked up my MacBook my girlfriend's daughter had a fashion show that she was in at Dillard's I took her to that because she had a prior engagement that she already committed to so we had a busy day and then after that we had Italian for dinner so it was a long day yesterday and today we are up bright and early well it's about nine o'clock I've been up to since about 6 30 I've just been chilling laying in bed relaxing I did let my dog out, fed my dog, did all that stuff. And we're drinking our greens shot. Y'all know I do this every morning. This is my 37 different fruits and veggies, my pre and probiotic. It's for good gut health. So today, you may notice I'm wearing a color that I don't normally wear. I am wearing pink today. My trainer is having an event today for National Women's Month to celebrate women. So it should be a super, super fun event. Um, doors open at 1030 and her, um, she's going to do a workout a sweat session at 11. It should be about 45 minutes to an hour. She's been my trainer for about three plus years. So that's what we're doing today. So that's exciting. I will bring y'all along with me so y'all can see that. So I'll make sure I got my charge. But that's all we're doing today. I'm going to finish drinking this and I'm going to do my tea. Fix my my edges and then we will get out of the door and get ready to go so what today usually i don't post usually i don't post but i want the world to know time to pull a drop top out Somebody. sit in the house netflix and chilling a gdm and game Share my love till I found someone I'm sure of Young and untamed I've been out of range Keeping it low But I wanna be bold with it Don't care we fall oh, yeah. Wow baby got a hold on it Don't let love unfold tonight Don't be calling us gold No lies so fair with it Go let them stare at it Now I'm prepared For it. instead of love 
laughed out loud since we ain't going away So tonight workout with Tish it was so so good we had a really really good sweat so now we about to go to Trader Joe's so I can get some stuff since I was in the area anyway we'll get us some flowers some salads things like that for the week getting my bags now but that's what we about to do now it is so nice outside today it is in the 70s so it is so gorgeous I thought it was gonna rain today but it didn't But I want the world to know I'm a good catch But I never let them catch me No, I never let them claim me Wild thing, try to tame me But you got my mood on sunshine Let's take a trip Souls on big smile Let's get this lake Stars are in smile We did our shopping I don't know why I have such bad lighting I'm trying to Okay, there we go we are going home. I'm going to stop at Krispy Kreme and get the kids some donuts. They love glazed donuts. So I'm going to go ahead and get that for them. It's also a good quick morning breakfast. put all the groceries away and then I had a taste for turkey burger but I didn't want to eat a turkey burger so I made turkey meatballs and I bought this mushroom and onion vegetables something or another I got from Publix so what I decided to make was this here and then I'm making the kids ravioli so they can then put this on top of this but this is all I'll eat so this is a vodka marinara sauce and it has mushrooms, onions, and then turkey meatballs. So this is all that I will eat. I'll have my protein and then my veggie with the mushrooms and onions. So, mmm, it smells so yummy. I cannot wait to eat it. I probably should have put some green peppers in there too. Um, I may do a side of spinach and I'll eat spinach with that as well. About to go have dinner with my glam bay. And then we're gonna run to Target. I don't think I checked in with y'all since I was last cooking some veggies. So we're about to go have dinner real quick. Hubby and Mason went to the movies. Um, so we're just hanging out. So let's see what we gonna eat. Hi, two. Okay. It's Shari, C-H-A-R-E-E. -E. bowl but it was supposed to come with peppers and onions Spanish rice but I told her to substitute Spanish rice for jasmine rice and they brought it and it was just that y'all saw it so who about to eat all that rice anyway and then it was just avocados and shrimp and some cilantro 
so I went ahead and still just ate that, but I didn't eat nearly all that rice. I just ate out that little corner, and then I had ordered a side of black beans, so that was a somewhat healthy meal. They have these avocado spring rolls. They are so good. The bad thing about them is they're fried, so the fried part is not good for you, but the avocado inside is amazing for you. So it was so good. So we are on our way to Target. I had placed an order for pickup, so I'm about to drive there now, and we about to pick up our order. Um, I don't know if I'll turn the camera back on tonight, but if not, I'll definitely see y'all tomorrow when we go back to the gym again. We did go to the gym this morning, and... We'll go again tomorrow, Saturday. So I'll check back in with y'all then. Let me pay attention so I can drive.